Hey guys, welcome to another episode of City Skyline. So uh, my friend Crown Shag is going to be joining us on a Skype call. His mic is terrible, and you can literally hear everything he's doing. So uh, if he joins back, I'm going to pause the video and sit there and yell at him. But anyways, uh, let's get started. So basically, we're going to expand into a bunch of condos and also, uh, holy crap, a blocks mark? Block, blocks mark makes a ton of money. Holy crap. We're going to try to save it for that once we get a bunch of McDonald's first. Um, it's going to take a while to uh, construct a lot of these. We have uh, plenty of population. As you can see, I also got rid of uh, some of my crappy buildings. I need to get rid of these uh, mobile homes, but uh, let's just uh, wait on that and just focus on getting stores since our population surplus is excellent right now. Um, so, yeah, let's get started. Um, we could buy like a bunch of cheap gas stations or something, but that doesn't really make a huge impact on our money at all. Uh, I mean, if we get like five McDonald's, that's like 3,500 per 13 seconds right there. That's pretty good money. And, uh, so, uh, we could actually, uh, get pretty far with that. So let's get started with that. Okay. Now we have another McDonald's or McDonald's. God damn it. Australians. Um, don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you guys uh, want more uh, videos of Roblox in this game in general as well. I keep forgetting to do that in my intro. It's something new I'm doing. Alright. And I, I'm very thankful that we reached 10,000 subscribers. That's that's awesome. Five digits, man. If we get to those six digits, then we can get the silver play button. That's like one of my huge goals right now. And, uh... That's... I don't know. <laughs> but... Uh, we'll have some special stuff coming up for you guys. I don't know if we'll have the special stuff up, this stuff up before we upload the, this video. I might upload it at school just because way better upload speed, but we'll see what happens. Hope you guys enjoy this. But uh, so yeah, more McDonald's. We're gonna turn into a McDonald's cities and or cities. What? This is just one city. We're gonna make all of our citizens super fat, you know, and uh, we're gonna try to. Uh, make FDA approve of McDonald's which oh, we all know that FDA is com completely corrupt well America is in general right now still a good country but the corruption is insanely high it is ridiculous how bad it is nowadays <sighs> I don't understand like I understand politicians are like oh I, I'm greedy and I need money do you realize how much freaking damage you're doing to the whole country when you make those kind of decisions? The power and the politicians and the government control everything nowadays. The people have no power. That's why we're losing so much money. It's always been like that, but it's insanely bad now. It is insanely bad. We have way more taxes than ever, you know, and all these people are very unhappy. There's all, there's all these tensions going on. But anyways, let's stop ranting be more positive stuff like that so let's do that um so i'm gonna put more condos along here maybe another mcdonald's over here and then we're gonna destroy all this stuff right here except for this skyscraper um which uh the code is 2k 2k 16 make sure you capitalized uh here we come i believe let me know if it works let's check out uh satch's city oh that's pretty cool doesn't have any roads though. That's okay though. You don't need roads. Roads are pointless. But I just want to have a uh, nice looking city. But uh, <laughs> let's get some more condos. Hopefully we can start getting villas because that would really help us out. And then we're going to tear down these mobile homes and uh, replace them with condos. The trailer parks are helping a little bit. We should get a bunch of trailer parks actually. No, I would not want to finish the building. Please. Let's put a, a bunch of temporary trailer parks down for now just so we can increase our population quite a bit more money please I need all the money give me there we go why is the game so bad gosh Trevor check your inventory <laughs> Sweet, he's got a skyscraper now. I'm 
going to ask him how many uh, expansions of land is this, because that's this is quite a bit of land right here. Oh, he just expanded again. Okay. Wow, my friend's got a lot of money. I wonder when he's going to join back. He's busy uh, kind of having fun times in his meeting. All right. What? Well, how did our population get so high all of a sudden? Oh my goodness, what? There's no way. Okay, that's a good spot for them. Wait, one of our, one of our trailer parks didn't even load. That doesn't make any sense. Now, we must have another McDonald's. Make people even more obese. Mc, McDonald's actually uses like real ingredients and stuff, but it's like so processed that it's so bad for you. I wish people would come to a realization that you need to stop spending half your money trying to lose weight and do things naturally. And people are always like, oh, healthy food is expensive. It's actually less expensive. Tell me again when you buy unhealthy food and then you have another medical bill because of your bad health problems through your eating habits of your bad food. Get wrecked. <laughs> In reality, though, yeah, it is more expensive. But you also got to understand that you got to budget things. You can't just sit there and complain that healthy food is too expensive. There's ways to budget things. Just like with the muscle building diet. There's ways to build muscle for cheap with your diet. Like get a bunch of chicken, for instance. Chicken's great. And it's cheap. I mean, what is it like? I don't even know. I know it's not that expensive, though. Everything's expensive nowadays. But it's really bad in certain states. I'm glad I don't live in those states. Okay. We're gonna get another McDonald's again. <laughs> Just keep, we're gonna have like all freaking condos and all McDonald's like pretty soon here, and things are gonna get out of control because we'll have too many McDonald's. But that's okay. <laughs> so now what we're probably gonna do next is uh, get rid of these mobile ho or yeah mobile homes, and then replace that with condos. These condos look nice. They're not. They don't look like condos though. Condos look way different than this. Oh well. This is probably the most boring type of building right here. That state, that Empire State building looks real nice. It doesn't boost you too much. It's really good for the beginning of the game and overall making your city look better. What is storage for? Is it for inventory? Okay. Okay, so it is for inventory. How many spaces do we have then? Is there, I'm going to sell these things. We don't need taco carts anymore. We actually are going to get like nearly $1,000 from that. We don't, know, we don't need this either. Okay. Warning, you have gone past your limit. So, let's build more condos. <laughs> Solution, build more condos. We're earning $4,200 per 13 seconds. We are growing fast. At first, when we started this game, especially in the last episode, we were only making a couple hundred dollars, like, every 15 seconds. And we did not nearly have as much cash or population at that time, either. I gotta go for dinner. I'm gonna go ahead and be right back. And I'll probably have, like, tons of freaking cash as well. I don't want to be boring and be like, oh, BRB. And then, you know, you just watch a blank video for another 15 minutes, but... Uh, I'm just going to pause it. I don't want to end the episode at 9 minutes, so let's do this. Oh my god, we have a lot of money. But anyways, let's uh, see what we want to do with this much money. Excuse me. We could uh, save up... Gosh, I can't read for some reason. Like, I think my eyes are adjusting still, but... Um, anyways, we can get a retro diner that has 22 jobs... Makes eight thousand nine hundred dollars, um, so we could go that route, or we could, uh, eh, we could get a couple villas, which I don't, it could help us. We could get a we, yeah, we could get a tennis court as well, storage roads, yeah. Let's go ahead and get a retro diner next. That'll be pretty cool. Um, we'll need to put down some more condos or villas, whatever we want to do with that. But let's go ahead and save up. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, well, let's just, eh, let's get rid of these for now. Not really helping us out anyway. Our population is going to not do so well, but 
Oh well, it's only five people, whatever. I'm just gonna randomly destroy your uh, mobile home and get the heck out of my city. Alright, so we've 74 people living here now. And we need one, two more payouts for the, maybe th even three for the diner. Anybody say anything? Okay. Dang, I don't know what's up with... Let's check out Trevor's base. He's got a bunch of gold storage units now. Does need them, I guess. Alrighty. So, now we have enough. Let's get the retro diner. This thing looks... 1 minute 45 seconds. How much is it? Eh. We're not gonna bother with it. We're gonna have to put down some more condos somehow in time before the thing gets done. Otherwise, it's not gonna really make us any money at all. Let's go ahead. Get rid of the gas station. We're gonna lose a little bit of income, but oh well. Why won't you get out of... I want to store you! I think we have storage. Storage. Okay. Ah, I see. I think you have to have six diamond warehouses to get plus uh, 30 storage. Okay. Uh, why? Okay, let's get more condos. I hope we have enough. Otherwise, we're going to suffer. Come on, pay me. Pay me. There we go. Another condo here. Could remove these uh trailer parks. Basic store. Why can't I Oh yeah, that's right, my inventory's full. Duh. Actually, why don't we sell stuff? Freaking having the dumbest idea. Why am I stuck at zero? Why don't you just get out of my inventory? My gosh, you game. Why? Oh well. Love how it's being constructed, that's cool. You can hear it too. Got a little flashy car right there as well. Let's go ahead and build another condo. So we get paid again. Uh, we're kind of over 15 above the population now. <laughs> our income spiked even though we... Once we get more uh, housing, we're in, our income is going to keep on going up and up and up. It's going to be sweet. Alright, income, here we come. Let's put it this way. Oh yeah, twelve thousand dollars now. Once this condo finishes up, we'll probably have like, whoa! Did we lose a bunch of money? Okay, let's see if we can store this. Okay, now we can. Coolio. Alrighty. So, oh, he's still having that meeting. That's why. Let's put this uh, condo that way. We don't. <sighs> Never mind. But. Um, once we get a uh, pretty good income going, we actually do right now. We're going to go ahead and get some um, moral stuff, like a tennis court, and decrease our seconds. That's probably our wise, wisest investment right now. We're down to 11. For some reason, it puts down 2 seconds. 11, 13 to 11 seconds, our income is going to get pretty darn fast now. We are we're making bank, guys. Holy crap. Um, okay. So go to back to stores. I can buy all the McDonald's I want now. Let's just do retro diners, because, uh... Dang, they made a huge difference. It was worth going to AFK, to be honest. Ah, shucks. Didn't want to do that. We could start getting villas, too. I don't know. Let's go ahead and get rid of these. And then replace it with condos. Gotta get all those condos. Condos are, like, nothing to buy anymore. I can buy them in a couple seconds. Pretty good, I would say. No, I don't want to pay for it. Gosh darn it. At least when they're constructed, you don't ever have to construct them again. Which is nice. Um, let's place another condo over here. And we can leave some more stuff open. So much construction! Construction everywhere! Look at how detailed that retro diner is. Is that individual parts or a texture right there? I hope that's not individual parts. Alright, sorry about that. Family members interfering with my videos. That's okay though, but that'd be cool if I could record with my sisters or something, but they don't want to. So, alright. They should do YouTube though. 
Anyways, so we're uh, we're constructing a villa right now. I think it's called a villa, at least. Yes, it's called a villa. It's like a like it's like a house. Hill, a loft holds so much for a million dollars. Oh my goodness! Dang. How does a loft hold uh, like ninety six people? Just flood them all in there. Let's get more retro diners next, because that's gonna be our best investment or the best investment. But we're gonna get a lake next, so we can get our time down even farther. That's gonna help us out a ton. And that diamond warehouse is really helping us out for now. Let's go ahead and sell these uh, things we don't need. Make a little bit of extra money. Sorry guys, selling you. Only a couple thousand extra dollars, but you know, that always helps. Actually, might have made like nearly 10k from that. That's a lot. All right. So, why am I going to storage? Let's get a lake built. Dupe. I love how you don't have to construct these. Now we're down to nine seconds. We're making bank. Dang. Sweet. Got a bunch of condos like everywhere now. We're like condo and McDonald's city right now, with the diner. It's got like a random diner and then with a random skyscraper. Pretty nice city now. We're still not ready to expand though. We can keep on uh, replacing everything until we need to. Let's go ahead and get rid of these as well and replace them with villas. I want to make sure I have plenty of residents and then we can get more shops and just save up beyond there. Uh, we need a lot more money now, again. What is the next uh, moral thing? Basketball court. 650k. We could get it, but we'd have to save up for a very long time, like probably like five minutes. So I'm not going to bother with it right now. We're just going to get another villa. These villas take forever to construct. Hmm. Let's check our settings again. Quests. Again, these are just badges, so I don't think there's a way. <laughs> There's no. This is good for starting out, though. But like, it would be completely useless for us to buy cash unless if we spent a lot of robux, in which I don't have those robux right now. All right, let's get another villa once again. <laughs> We're really expanding right now. Oh, what the heck is that? Is that a villa? Hopefully, it, that's not a villa. I'm so tempted to German to a uh, tubex. Why does everybody look like a noob? Maybe he doesn't. Maybe he purposely did. I don't know. It doesn't matter though. Do what you love. My friend Trevor expanded again, but he's built absolutely nothing. And Zero Excess has like over a billion dollars, but he hasn't done crap. Oh, he's walking on my base right now. Never mind. What has he done? Music's playing. What is this building? What is this thing? Looks really cool though. I don't know what this is either. Looks like a mansion. Oh, Satch uh, left us. Cry, cry. Yeah, I. The heck is that thing? What is that? Oh, it's a basic. No, I don't want a basic house. Looks nice, but no. <laughs> don't need it at all. Let's get another retro diner. We have plenty of citizens anyway. Those villas look so much nicer than the condos. Let's go ahead and rotate this thing. Gotta have it all symmetrical. I'm just... I don't want to leave this game because I know if I leave, everything's going to get rotated, which is really annoying. That that happened in Miner's Haven as well. It's like, ah, why? Why do you do this? Car dealership makes, like, four times more money, but it costs, like, three times more... Should we save up for it? We have enough we have enough capacity. Let's get another retro diner and then we can save up for it in the next episode. Construct. Anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the series so far of City Skylines on Roblox. Don't forget to subscribe and like to leave some comments and I think that'll be all. And I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later, and that'll be all.